Hello, HVA uh, history students and families. Uh, this is a really quick video at the end of quarter three to show you how to uh, check your grade, make sure you are, uh, are feeling good about what you have, and how to raise your score if you need to. Okay, so um, I'm in the Canvas course for Contemporary World Problems, but to start with, I wanna actually move over to Student View. And so inside Student View, I'm gonna take a look at my history course. Um, this is the Contemporary World Problems course, but all the history classes uh, are gonna operate in a pretty similar way. Uh, once you click on that initial, um, uh, uh, once you click on the, the name of your history course in the gradebook, it's gonna take you to this content uh, course page. Instead, click over to standards view, and you're gonna see that you have a, a number of different standards um, that are, are lining up, that are, that are you know, contributing to your overall grade. And so let's say this student wants to raise their grade from a C to a B or an A. What they're gonna do is they're gonna look down here to see which of the standards are they uh, showing up the lowest on. And so right now, what it is is gonna be this uh, central idea standard and this point of view standard. And so we're gonna click here first, and we're gonna see, okay, week four, central idea, and then we're going to click here and we're going to say week eight POV or point of view assessment. So again, that was week four and week eight are, are both missing. OK, so now I'm going to go back to the Canvas course and I need to find week four and week eight. So on the home page of your history class, we're going to go all the way down to the bottom and you can see all of the assessments for each week listed out. So we're going to need the week four assessment and the week eight assessment. Click on those, complete them, turn them in, and use the contact information here uh, to get help. Uh, you can come by our, our Zoom for assessment support. You can also just take a picture of what you're working on and send us um, a, a text message on our Google Voice number or an email. But if you're working on this like you know, in the afternoon or the evening and you're not exactly sure what a question means or if you did it right, Maybe you're like halfway through and you want to make sure that it's looking good. Just take a picture of it with your phone and then text it to one of us and, uh, and we'll, get, um, we'll get back to you with some feedback. I guess I did not need to email Ms. Bedell. There was one other thing um, I wanted to show you. Up here um, on the right-hand side of the homepage is going to be a to-do list. Um, this should be a list of the assignments that you need to do, um, but it's also right beneath it. Uh, where mine says coming up. Uh, for students, it'll actually say recent feedback. So right here, you're gonna see any recent feedback that you got on assignments that you turned in. What that, what that looks like is like, let's say, let's say for this one, uh, you know, you hear you got a two on this standard. And, and so we wanna, um, we wanna raise that up from a two to a three or a 3.5 or a four. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna see, okay, that was the week two assessment. Back in Canvas, we would come over here and we'd look for recent feedback we look for the week two score. There's gonna be your score as well as comments from Ms. Bedell or myself, and that'll show you how you can reassess, you know, what you, what you did right and what you need to um, add or fix uh, to raise the score. Um, feel free to revise and resubmit, and as long as things are, are in to us by Friday at the end of the day, we will make sure that it counts towards your quarter three grade. All right, have a great day, everybody.